Welcome back to Nam's Fatten Herds. In this part, we are still in arcade mode, but this time we are going to use a third character to complete it. We already played as a cow, a reindeer, and now all that's left is four more fighters. And since we were already introduced to her in story mode, let's try Paprika. A bouncy alpaca that apparently breaks the fourth wall and is considered a monster in her hometown of the Highlands. Anyway, let's see who we fight first. Stop wasting my time, you foolish feedback. Round one. Fight! Okay. Well done. Again. And for this fight, it's pretty I see. unorthodox compared to some of the other characters. Paprika is able to no throw food, which she can use to recharge her magic. Her throw is a literal hug. And one of her attacks is literally the ability to... Well, in the last part, literally throw her fur as a shirt. And now, I give my character a chance to break the fourth wall on my side. And, well, her super attack is no big deal, it's just a big tackle thing. Can we just talk? Ready? Fight! And I think one thing that needs to be acknowledged is that... Paprika doesn't really talk like the other characters. And, well, this isn't really much of a challenge, but Paprika does ha have the ability to make some big combos. But, this is like easy mode, so some of them are. Unorthodox or more technical aspects of this game may not be shown off. It is convenient to be able to literally weaponize your magic ability. And. Okay. It is also pretty neat seeing her do like a second level for her big super. Fred, look alive! Of course. Round one. When you saw me make a super producing a basket that is like a second ability with super attacks that can be used when the level is at at least two or higher. Basically, an additional attack gets formed, and in Paprika's case, 
it produced a basket that he could use to throw stuff Round two. four or five times. It isn't really anything surprising, but I am going to be a bit more, I guess, acknowledging of this fight in regards to the fact that in the lore of Zen's Fighting Hurts, it is not this demon using unicorn to be afraid of, it's Paprika. Paprika he wins! Is a literal monster. Given that one of the things he does when Coming he was in Arizona's story mode was ambush her. I guess that does make some sense. But. Well, I'm mostly trying to set up some big combos, but. Okay. Some of the attacks that Paprika uses are rather. Well. Not really indicative of her more brutal nature, Round two. but... Fight. Here's something. Uh, trip. <laughs> if you do certain attacks with different varying power when it comes to her attack, like, that's one of her abilities with the most weakest option. The medium option involves using a thrown piece of a decay to hit an enemy. And the Paprika wins. strongest attack involves literally body slamming an opponent, so... <laughs> Let us break the ice! Round one. Fight! In regards to breaking the ice, I'm pretty sure that... Well, Paprika's probably gonna not really break the ice in a metaphorical sense, but... Okay. I was planning on eating those apples, but... Round two. Anyway. So, yeah, in them fighting herds, you have various fighting abilities. We saw Arizona with a mostly short reins or brawling type style. We played as Velvet here, where literally had more reins to her abilities, and we are going to play as Paprika with more, Paprika wins. I guess, sillier style? Anyway, uh, arcade mode always has you fight round yourself one. for fight. the final round. So... Okay. Let's see what happens when someone other than 
Rika has to deal with another Paprika. Or I guess, let's see how Paprika deals with a case of her own medicine. Getting a lot more damage than the other ones. And. Round two. Fight. Let's try. Throwing a free shirt around. If people who watched My Little Pony Friendship of Magic is familiar with the character, let's just say Paprika is based on a character that, that was perfect. broke the fourth wall a lot more frequently than Paprika ever did. I don't know if she was. Manic as Paprika is presented in the story. I mean, she definitely did not have the ability to get her fur to attack. Said character did have a literal cannon which used to make for a kind of party, which is neat. But... Anyway... Let's see if I can... beat up this final big predator. Or since we're fighting against Huggles here, let's see... If Huggles can handle actual hugs. And eh, turns out no. And yeah. In them fighting her, you press the down button several times and your fighter does it hot. It's over now. And that's Arcade mode with Paprika. Honestly, I kind of wish Paprika had a burning basket for her super art. But anyway, that is arcade mode for Paprika in them Spite and Herds. I will see you later, and please like and subscribe.